Hi, uh, this is Les Barnes, and I'm uh, coming to you today from uh, London Lenny's at our busy raw bar here in Queens, New York. And today I'm going to show you how to open our famous Blue Point oysters and show you some of the accompaniments that we serve them with. I'm just going to talk a little bit about the knives. We have two different types here. We have one with a curved tip and one with a straight tip. Uh, whatever you like to use is fine. Uh, I use the one with the curved tip. That's what I grew up on. Uh, and we're going to do Blue Point oysters here. Uh, when opening oysters, you want to make sure that you have them nice and iced down. They want to be as cold as possible. That'll help in the opening. They'll open up a little bit easier. Uh, if you've disturbed them and they're warm, uh, it's just going to make it a little harder to open. So these are nicely iced down. They've been sitting here for a few minutes, so they should be nice and relaxed. Uh, there's two different ways you can do it, either on a flat surface like this, which is probably the safest for the novice. Just insert your blade into the back hinge. Give it a little twist. And there you go. Uh, the important part is try not to cut the oyster. If you notice, there's no meat left on the, uh, <clears throat> the other side of the shell. That's just the abductor muscle that you have to cut through. Now that you have the opened oyster, you just take your knife, you cut the other side of that muscle, and then you have a nice blue point all ready to serve. Uh, a couple of points, though, that people often make a mistake. Oh, if there's a little bit of shell, just take your knife and flip it out. If there's a little bit of mud or sand, just flip it out. Never, ever run your oyster under running water or fresh water. You're going to take away all that beautiful brine that's in the oyster naturally. And then we have three different, uh, actually four different items you can have oysters with. This is uh, our mignonette sauce. That's a red wine vinegar and shallots with black pepper. Of course, horseradish, the old standby cocktail sauce. And something that we have here at London Lenny's, it's an Asian relish. It's cucumber, uh, peppers, and rice wine vinegar. Very, very popular for oysters. It's really very, very nice and refreshing for the oyster. For me, being an oyster aficionado, I prefer to eat them all natural. Just maybe just a little bit of squeeze of lemon, and that should be enough. So, here we go. Just like being at the seashore. Delicious. <laughs>